fire to present to you a skin on a good and bad service in a restaurant. So let's put our hands together and welcome them. That is getting ready for the performance. What you are seeing now has been put together by the students with a lot of hard work, effort and strength and many of them slept very late last night. So before the performance comes on stage, let's give them another big round of applause. This kid is going to present good service and bad service that can be provided. The characters are Hisham as Mario, Yechi as the girlfriend, Alvin as the boyfriend, Jessica as Ashley, Yechi as Juliet, and Clement as Romeo. This situation in which bad service is given is happening in Oops is strong. If you want to satisfy a customer, you have to understand their needs at once. Listen to what you have to say. So, what happens if you do not listen? An events planner in a restaurant is speaking to a customer over the phone. The customer wants to surprise his girlfriend on her birthday. That's okay. Ring, 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 ring. Mario, who is styling his hair, answers the call reluctantly. Hello? Hi, is that the Oaks restaurant? May I speak to the event coordinator, please? Yes, speaking. Oh, I'd like to celebrate my baby's birthday this Saturday. I want it to be a surprise. Then? She's turning 24 this Saturday. I want the setting to be done in a professional way. And it'll be great if you can bring the cake in as a surprise. We are about to start our dinner. It's gonna be the two of us. Oh, uh, what name? Uh, name, uh, are you? Okay, Saturday, table for two. What time? It's at 7 pm. Okay, bye. <laughs> In the restaurant, couple walks in and are unsure of the table they reserved. Mario walks in. Birthday, huh? You are the guy who got right? Yes, sir. Yeah, and understand the customer. This was the key point as to why the decorations went wrong and the customer got angry. Therefore, listening and catering to the customer's needs and want is crucial. The next clip will present on how good service is given. Hi, can I speak to the event coordinator, please? Yes, speaking. How do I address you, ma'am? 
This is Julia. Yes, Miss Julia. How may I help you? I wanted to celebrate my baby's birthday this Saturday and I want it to be a surprise for him. How old will be your baby this Saturday? He'll be turning 24. Oh, you mean your baby's actually your boyfriend? Haha. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> yes, yes. His name is? His name is Romeo. Okay, so do you have any special request on how would you want the surprise to be? It would be great if you bring in the cake as a surprise when we are about to start our dinner. Actually, if you don't mind, can I suggest bringing the cake after your dinner? That way you can have it as part of your dessert. Oh, that seems like a pretty good idea. Yes. So, is there anything else would you like me to prepare? Uh, nah, I guess that's about it. I'll leave the rest for you to decide. Okay, Miss Julia, what time would you like your reservation to be? Hmm, 7 p.m. would be perfect. Okay, ma'am. Therefore, to confirm, your boyfriend is turning 24 this Saturday. The table reservation for two is at 7 p.m. sharp. And the cake is to be served after dinner as a surprise. Is that it, ma'am? Yes, yes. Thanks, Amelia. Okay, no problem. See you this Saturday. Please feel free to call us back if any inquiries. Bye. Bye. Thank you. 